Ladies and gentlemen, Valentine's Day is right around the corner. I'm sure if you have that one special person, you're gonna shop for him or her. And I'm sure if you know about dropshipping, you want to make money on this holiday, which I, I hope you do, because it's very simple to capitalize on it. So I'm going to provide you with six products that you can dropship for Valentine's Day. I'm gonna actually give you the websites too that are actually running ads currently for the specific products. It's all gonna be linked in the description, so look for that. So that's kind of about it. I'm gonna hand you products and then you will be able to go on your way and make money this Valentine's Day. So let's get into the products. Number one is going to be a rose inside of a little dome with a personalized name card. I'll put a picture up right here. This product I saw on Google when I typed in Valentine's Day present. I saw this product and realized it was a dropshipping store. The link again is in the description for all of these products. A link to the website, not AliExpress, to a website selling them. So I saw this product, I was like, this is cool, but I don't think it's dropshipping. And then I went on AliExpress and saw the product for like 10 bucks or something along those lines. This product is gonna do well this Valentine's Day just because it looks cool and it has a rose and it has personalization to it when you can have the card in the bottle that says the name on it or whatever. It's not a bottle, it's like a little dome. When it says someone's name on it, that just makes someone feel like it was thoughtful and like it took time because it has to take time to type up a card and put it in there. It's not like it's just a generic rose in a little dome that comes with nothing that has no tie to the person. So when you have this and you can sell this and have it be personalized, that's where you can get people on emotion. And when they see that and they see your ad for it, they potentially may buy it from you. So that is number one. Okay, I'm editing this video right now. The first product actually isn't personalized. Um, it's like this. Let me focus. It says homemade. And I thought it said your name. Um, so let's have this focus. So first one is not pro uh, customized or personalized, but it's still a cool product. It still will sell well. So just wanted to make that clear so you guys aren't like gonna roast me in the comments. Now let's get back to the video, enjoy. Another one, very similar product, this one. It's an LED rose display. Like it, it's in a glass display and it has LED, a string of LED lights through it with a cool rose in it. So this product will also do well this Valentine's Day just because anything with the rose normally sells. People like to get their girlfriends or their wives flowers and if you can have something that lasts longer than a week or two, that would be awesome. So when they see this, they're like, oh my God, well I normally buy her flowers, but if I could get something that lasts till next year, that would be awesome. Because then she'll remember it every time she sees it and then it'll be just more of a thoughtful and long-term present rather than just ordering a ton of flowers and having them be delivered. Which you still should do if you have a girlfriend. Uh, don't skimp out on flowers, girls like those but this could also be a cool alternative or addition to that gift. So I think you guys should dropship that one too. That one's very cool, looks awesome. It comes with a cool little display as well. So that's gonna be product number two. Product number three, and these the first three are all roses. They're all rose type of products. The third one is a 24 karat galaxy rose. So basically it's a 24 karat gold plated rose in a little box that's, the roses are a clear, it's almost like a clear plastic or glass type of material. This one looks, here's a picture right here. This one looks awesome and I saw it and I was like, this one is also going to sell really well. Reason being, again, same thing as the other two. It's a rose, people like roses, people like giving girls roses. This one is definitely less intricate and is more of a simple design. So that's good because you may be able to sell quantity. Maybe someone's gonna buy this product who doesn't have a girlfriend and he buys 10 to hand them out at his college and then collect some leads and potentially have some future dates. So you never know. That's why this product is good because it's a lower ticket one and it still looks pretty badass. Number four, I've sold this product, custom name bracelet right here. These work really, really well. I do, I do influencer marketing with this product pretty often. Like I sold it last year, I'll sell it this year. And it's just an overall cool product because again, this ties into the number one product where I said personalization. If you can order a product and have it say someone's name on them, and then they get it and open it up, they realize that you put in thought. It's not a last minute product that someone went to the store the night prior and, or, and bought. It's like something that they ordered and took time to develop 
and I guess think of in a sense. So a custom name bracelet, I suggest you guys also can dropship that. I think just open up one product stores for all of these. So pick one and run with it. Don't try to juggle them, just scale one. Uh, one of these products that I'm gonna say has been scaled to hundreds of thousands of dollars daily last year uh, and still can be this year. So I'm gonna show that one next. But you just have to constantly keep in mind why people are buying a product. They wanna make their significant other feel special and feel unique. So when you have that overall thought in mind and sell to that angle, sell at that angle where you wanna make them feel unique and not like every other Valentine's gift, uh, that's where you can get into personalized products because that sells really well. Number five, the Rose Bear. I'm almost certain you guys have heard of this product. If you haven't, you may be living in a ditch and I'm sorry, but you need to open your eyes because this product has been marketed so much and you may be thinking to yourself, Seba like, you know, Sebastian, this product was sold last year and the year before that. Why would it sell again this year? What? What do people buy every single year for their significant other? Roses, even though like the year before they got their girlfriend roses or whatever, flowers just in general, do you think they're gonna get something different? No, flowers are always a go-to. So if you can get a rose bear and go to that extent where you have flowers on a bear, that's even better. And people may buy this every single year as a sort of tradition with their significant other. So this product, yes, it still will be scaled to millions of dollars this season. And I strongly suggest you get a piece of that pie while you can because it's a hot product and will sell heavily. The last product right here, it's a love necklace that says love in a hundred languages. I've seen this product for the past two years, maybe I think two years, and it sold very consistently throughout the whole time frame of its existence. Reason being, there's always gonna be someone in a relationship and someone in a fresh relationship, someone in a long-term one that kind of thinks that they should buy them the significant other something. So if they see this and they're like, wow, this is really cool my other or my girlfriend not other girlfriend yeah girlfriend number three would like this no um my girlfriend would like this so i'm gonna order this that's their mentality with this product because this one's cool they can wear it on a daily basis and it gets people wondering like what is that because if you look at it it doesn't really look like anything crazy but then when you can explain to someone it actually says love in a hundred languages i think it's love or it's like i love you or something along those lines and then you can just flash a light through the whole, the little hole and shine it onto like a wall, I believe that's how it works. And then you can see all of the different languages that it says it in. So that is another cool product. Now for marketing all of these, I'm going to give you the same advice. I would recommend you do influencer marketing with these, find some meme pages that are willing to promote this product or any of these products for a low price because of the fact that meme pages have so many followers and so many of the people who follow meme pages are either in an early relationship or a long-term one. Another one, you could uh, do relationship pages. There was one called relationships.usa that I used, I think a year ago, that doesn't exist anymore for some unfortunate reason, but find those relationship pages and run influencer posts on them, pay them and get a sick ad created that looks like it's a normal post on the page and you should do well this Valentine's Day. You can also run Google ads and Facebook ads. They all work, but if you're just beginning, I would suggest influencer marketing for you to kickstart your dropshipping career. That is gonna wrap up this video for Valentine's products. Hope you guys did enjoy that list of six. Now, don't forget, I'm gonna have links in the description for all six of them to a website that is currently selling them. It's not like it's a website that's never sold them or that isn't even running ads. They're currently running either Facebook ads or Google ads. So I'm gonna give you guys links to all of those websites so you can literally go on the site, look at what's working for them, and then take note of that when you're creating your own site so that you can have a great success, great success. Um, so you guys can have a good start to this whole business. So you guys could be better off uh, rather than going in the dark. But other than that, hope you guys did get value and I hope you guys do take action with any of these products. Get started, the, they all work. Valentine's Day is in a month. So get started right now because you have to keep in mind long shipping times. Make sure your customers know that there's long shipping times. It would suck to have someone rely on this product and then not get it by Valentine's Day because then they won't have a gift for their significant other, other and they're gonna look like a douchebag. So make sure that you are making all that stuff clear. But other than that, hope you guys again got value. Thumbs up the video if you haven't already. And if you haven't subscribed, I've told you this many times, we can't be friends until you click that subscribe button. So do click that subscribe button. And if you have any comments or recommendations for future videos or just wanna say what's up, drop that in the comment section below. But other than that, I will see you guys in tomorrow's video. Peace.